Hey guys, so today I am in a very creative mood. I really need to create something. So even though I'm tired and it's late, I, I just I have to create something. Um, so today I'm going to be doing some collage and I have um, this scrapbook paper here. And I am not going to be using any colored acrylic paint. The only paint, acrylic paint that I'm going to be using is gesso because I need gesso. <laughs> but I'm not going to be using any of my craft paints, only gesso, and I'm going to see what other media I want to use. But yeah, so I'm going to get started. I'm not even going to gesso this because I'm not going to gesso this first. This is already pattern paper that I like, and I'm just going to add some paper, and we'll see what happens. So for color, I'm going to go in with some pastels. Um, these are oil pastels, and I have some very natural colors here. Um, and I didn't, I don't really like pastels. I remember I used them, I don't know, once or twice, and I just thought they were such a hard medium to work with. But I'm going to try again today, since I'm not using any um, acrylic. And so, yeah, I'm just going to try them. Ah, so... We'll see what happens. Okay, so I want to say that these are not water-soluble pastels. I do have some of those kind of pastels where you, you, know, you mark it on your paper and then you add water and it activates it and then it like, spreads. These are, these are oil pastels. They're not supposed to do that. But um, I saw a video by Jenny Belly and she was adding water to her pastels. So I thought I would try it. And it is spreading it, um, which is cool. I want, I really want this like dirty, grungy kind of effect, so I mean it's doing it for me. But yeah, these are not um, supposed to be like water soluble or anything, they're just oil pastels. So yeah, I'm going to continue. Okay, I'm so tired. <laughs> I don't think I can create any more today. 
So I want to do some homework before I go to bed. But I am going to spray this with hairspray to set it. Because oil pastels have to be setted or whatever. <laughs> so I'm just going to spray this. continue to create tomorrow. So now I'm going to just glue stuff onto my page. I have these um, little like, ticket things that I printed out from, from, from Pinterest and then cut them out. These were a free print. And I don't know where I got these, but they're not stickers. They're just like little cardboard um, dominoes. So I'm thinking about putting those there. And I also have these print out letters that I might put somewhere and some ribbon so we'll just see where they go. But yeah, I'm just going to start gluing these on. Done. and I like this page so much I love all these tickets here and the, the newspaper peeking through and I put the date in Roman numerals I like how the the pattern paper is still showing I didn't completely cover it up these dominoes I've been wanting to use these for so long and I finally used them it was the perfect page for them and then I had some printouts some letter printouts and I put a T there of course for Tyler I really like that there. And then I put making mistakes is better than faking perfection. And I just like how this page just looks really like old and I don't know. Just with the, the pastels really gave it that really cool look. And I think just with the tickets and everything, it just it's perfect. So yeah, I really like the page. I hope you guys enjoyed watching me. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.